to start the match. What move is Jan going to play? Anish, quickly, what's your call? E4. Handshake has occurred the first game of the 2023 FIDE World Championship has concluded in peace. And indeed. Whoa! What? H3? Them. The board is no, long. No, he's played H3. Just... Mm, some support for Ding now there, please. Yeah, it's he... painful. Resign. Every day now, Ding was going to try to come back. It's a drop. Handshake is coming. Oh. Question mark. Briefly appeared yes. there. Why on earth would you allow any of this and he's already taken? And we saw it on the screen. Double exclamation mark move. A winning, brilliant move. Being definitely sped up with some decisions at some point and Yang got carried away. And there we go. Handshake. Ding wins. So this is like the third category of move. He's not trading. Uh, the light squared bishop. He's not moving the rook. He is instead solving, as you said, the problem of the dark squared bishop. Well, g5 was the punch, and I think if you're choosing between the G. two, I, I don't know. Maybe queen e8. Uh, queen e8. Is yeah, queen e8. I was thinking too. Yeah. Queen e8. Yeah, is a bit better. I'm trying to. Yeah, and with three seconds on the clock. No, when I first... Okay, and I will interrupt my story because Ding has just resigned the game. He has stopped the clock. The handshake has occurred. And Jan Epomnishi once again holds a one-point lead in the 2023 World Championship match. Even when you don't need to be honest, I've heard this way. So I expect one C4. And we're off. We have the handshake. Yes, he does. He oh, is. No. Oh, wow. no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> the London. It was a very similar situation where you go E5, E4. Not queen takes c3, I think. Gave it check instead. Jan has resigned, you called it. No beautiful checkmate on the board, but still a beautiful game, beautiful finish from Ding. And here we go, handshakes. And he goes with the wow. French. What, what Less is going than a minute. Now? under a minute. Is Why is he, what, what is he He's doing? He's under a minute, he's thinking. There's no increment. No way. Oh, That's it. Makes a move. One resigns. Wow. Well, no London, as we were saying. 2C4 has been played. Oh, does he sacrifice the rook? Oh, beautiful. Is there a perpetual? Beautiful, beautiful perpetual idea. He didn't find oh. it. He missed it. Wow. He doesn't go 94. Wow. He's trying to um, force the knight back to f6. Goes knight f2. And that Amazing deserves stop. the double exclaim. I mean, that was a big decision. He, he has to make a move. Hey, 10 seconds. One. one more move remains. We should just oh do a status quo move. Look that. at him. He's so upset. There's a draw agreed. Fair oh. result. But oof, what a match we have. It looks like he's about to make a move. Did he make. Knight to g6, so Ian wow, answered your question for us. Yes! The writing's on the wall. It's a draw. If still it was a win, why would win this position? The rook of one is going to be a draw and being there with a smile. So just a draw. Yeah, there we see. Who offer a draw in this position? I make that it's a brilliant move, and that we see the glyph appear there. It's a like double X limb. And Abby, he just goes for rook to g8 instead. Is there? What is the problem with this move? It does take care of the threat of knight f3, but what does it walk into? Oh my goodness! Whoa. The evaluation bar went all the way up, and Dingley runs favor. Oh my goodness! Ding's choice. He also doesn't find the best move. Plays f5. Five. It's oh, losing the spot. <laughs> Even though 
if you're a Ding the Red fan, you're thrilled. I think even then you're still upset for Jan just because of you know, how he's feeling right now. Handshakes, and that is it. He's six on the board. We have a handshake. The game is in the books. That means we still have a tied match. Bishop D2, and this one as well has been a topic of conversation in the NIM zone. Question mark. That's not clear to me. But this position has made it worse for white people. So play on the queen side. So knight c5 and. And oh. that's it. We've got handshakes, and it's a drop. 14th classical game after a marathon seven of a five ends peacefully. Big five, six decisive games. The match is level and goes down to the wire. The 2023 world champion will be decided in speed chess. It will all happen tomorrow. We see the players there. They are analyzing. What a fantastic finish. What a big fight this has been in game 14 and throughout the match. It's a reset. It's not going to be easy for Yan or for Dinglerin. Back to the live board we see cb6 ab6 has been played and that was an inaccuracy apparently by ding the rem but the evaluation bar is still only slightly in jan's favor a takes b6 is a brilliant move e5 hang so he has to stay connected to that rook on h1 and there we see what a draw this has been handshakes the first game out for the world to see and to enjoy and we see the handshakes and get involved i know look at this view jan de Pomsi playing spanish Look at Jan, he knows that there's absolutely nothing here. It may look like a bad posture. Uh, they are just moving the rooks around and a three-fold repetition, and that's a draw agreed. Jan with a shake of head there. He's not happy defending this position. Even that tunnel. But this is just an easy draw. This has been the most peaceful game. Queen oh. 2, you actually do. He probably didn't see that one. It's a brilliant move. Oh, oh my god. Oh! <laughs> what? Is he playing for a win? Is Dingley Ren trying to win this game? That was a mistake. Oh, Queen D3. Not even Queen G4, Queen D3. That's the best way. Indicating the pawn he goes Queen C7, which is a mistake. A huge mistake in time travel from Yonda Pomsi. The Queen has to go back to G6. That's the good news for Dingley Ren. He has only one move here. Yonda Pomsi, he sits up in his chair. Knows this might be the last few moves of his world championship. Oh my god. Oh, you see it. He, and he, he gives knows. Up. He knows it. Yeah, Bishop takes up fours. It's over. Ding Luren is the world just champion. Wow. He has made history as the first Chinese player to will win the world championship. We see handshakes that Ding is overtaken by emotions. He isn't able to leave the board. And for Yan Nepomnishi, a heartbreaking moment there. He leaves the hall. This has been a fight of courage, of grit and determination. And all of that has paid off for Ding Darren. Take a moment and admire Ding right now. What a match this has been and a deserving victory for Ding Darren. Yes, 2023 world champion.